Divine seasons. People, listen to me. When you read the Bible, you know what I see God doing time after 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 time? I see God tilling the soil, breaking, ripping, purging, getting it down to nothing. He's always, and there's a lot of, there's a lot, not near as many where God lifts up. God takes Stephen and gets him stoned to death before he goes to heaven. God takes Paul and puts him through, I don't know how many times it says he almost died. God takes Moses and gives him two million people that go, we don't want to go. God takes all these folks, you know, Zacchaeus has to climb a tree because he's little. I mean, one after another, they're just beating all these guys up and beating us up and beating us up and beating us up. But I, I see that it's a divine season. Listen to me. God has you in a place, and it's a season to lift you up and a season to tear you down, a season to plant you and a season to purge you. You feel like you're being crushed. You have problems in your life. You have disease. You have challenges. But listen to me. Why do these come? He, that is God, will not let you be set in your way because if you are, He can't use you. And so He uproots you. 